in terms of giving the interview and acquiring knowledge so you need to work on your ds skills previously i have worked for companies like paytm now i am working for paypal Hi and welcome back to Coding Ninjas guys I'm Kapil Singh and I'm here with another spectacular interview experience for you guys so today we have Shubham Jain and he has cracked the company PayPal so we're going to discuss how he went with the, the interview how many rounds were there and we'll try briefing every round out for you guys so that whenever you guys can go and sit for that company you might have a pre preparation out there when you listen to this interview experience also uh, shubham has written an article for coding ninjas or over our website for the same uh, interview experience i would mention the link in the description below you can always go and check out the link and also solve the problems that were asked to him in his interview so let's get started hi shubham how are you doing yeah hi so i'm doing good how are you doing i'm good i'm good shubham can you give me a small introduction about yourself and then we can hop into the interview experience yeah sure so myself shubham and uh, i have over 10 year experience building apps so i build apps like mobile apps including ios android other platforms like flutter phone gap so these type of uh, experience i have gained since my 10 year experience so okay. previously uh, i have worked for uh, companies like paytm now uh, i am working for paypal building some great apps and doing some great work yeah thanks that's great that's great okay so when you start for the interview for paypal how many rounds were there yeah there were uh, five technical rounds and uh, one hr round so that was non technical okay there were five technical rounds and one hr round so if we try briefing the rounds out for our audience would you like to tell me what was there in the first very round when you sat for the interview yeah so the first round was the screening round for ios so it contains mm-hmm. the basic of ios so okay. mostly like the basic concepts of ios that will check uh, your basic knowledge of uh, swift and objective c okay that's great that's yeah. great and how long did that interview go for yeah it was 1 hour uh, so mostly it is like 45 minute and uh, 15 minute of your doubts and other questions okay and what would you rate the difficulty level of that round Me- easy medium or hard i think it is like uh, easy to medium yeah you can rate it like uh, somewhere between, uh, between easy and medium easy to medium yeah That's great. That's great. And now moving forward to the second round, what actually happened in that? Yeah, second was the DS and Algo round. So mm-hmm. it consists of two problem solving online round. It's not like a online test. It is more like a video call, okay. which contains two questions. And uh, if you ask about the difficulty, it was one easy and one medium. Okay, one easy and one and, medium. That's great. Yeah. So it was like a forty-five minute total, forty-five minutes of round, and plus fifteen minutes for extra like the doubts. And and other stuff about the company if you have that's great yeah. that's great and now moving on to the third round what happened in that third was also a ds and algo round it was okay. uh, like more difficult i would say it contains two medium questions and uh, in the same time we need to you know go through it and give a uh, optimal solution to the interviewer okay okay that's that's really nice so now when we talk about the round after that what actually happened in that the second last round was the design round it contains a system test or a screen test where we need to build a small prototype that will be testing our skills architecture in the ios platform and okay. uh, needs to convince the interviewer about uh, your skill set that you are good and can generate a scalable app through your experience okay and this all happens live like at the moment you have to code it up and show it to them yeah yeah so this is a real time problem solving interview that's a fourth round yeah okay and how much time again 45 minutes yeah same same yeah same 45 minutes and what would you rate the difficulty of this round being let's consider somebody who doesn't have 10 years of experience considering somebody who just started who's a beginner level person would you rate it to be easy for them oh no i think it will be medium to hard for them if it's mm-hmm. a beginner and uh, if he's uh, somewhat uh, after 4 to 5 year then it will be like uh, uh, easy to medium for him okay okay so you yeah. need to be a little more experienced in the terms of mobile application development if you you know want to uh, go through your interviews easily yeah but i would say the it's the hardest uh, in all the four rounds because okay. it will be testing our skills uh, and it will be testing the knowledge in depth 
which you right, really right. can't prepare but uh, you will have to work in your career to be able to understand all those questions right it's like so, something which comes with experience you can't really prepare for it yeah right right correct correct okay and moving on to the final round what actually happened in that so the last one was a hiring manager round where they will be you know giving you all the knowledge about the teams that you will be joining and what are the expectations from you and uh-huh. uh, asking about the projects that you have worked on and uh, about the code quality that you can come up if you are onboarding to the team okay so, okay yeah. that's that's really nice so what after all of these things you had an hr round as well right yeah once uh, the profile is shortlisted uh, hr will be discussing some stuffs like uh, your pay scale your past experience your documents that are required so all these mm-hmm. things moreover non technical but uh, is really important because you need to have those documents and you need to you know discuss on the pay scale if right. that looks good to you correct correct i guess that's really important when you sit for an interview so when you talk about this entire five round experience shubham what would you say like was it a very smooth experience for somebody who's a beginner or they might have some obstacles that which they have to tackle out so that they can get smoothly out you know back into that position for them so i would say the interview conduct person or the recruiter was very smooth and supportive in terms of uh, if you would want to reschedule as it uh, when it comes to giving interview in your working day you will have to manage your time based on uh, your working day as well as your interview mm-hmm. experience so i would so in terms of conducting the interview it was very smooth and right. uh, in terms of giving the interview and acquiring knowledge so you need to work on your ds skills right i have like uh, gone through the lead code and coding ninjas as well to prepare for the dsa and algo round and uh, for the ios it's like my skill so uh, i have prepared from you know multiple past experience uh, like things which are in trend and the things which are coming new and which are like the latest updates i have to read about correct 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 that's that's really nice yeah. so i was really amazed with this because this is the first time we are having an interview with uh, you know somebody who was there into mobile application so i really thank you for giving out this interview experience to us and again guys if you want to read his interview experience out i'll put the link in the description below always go have a look try practicing more problems and uh, you know that's going to really help you to crack interviews like shubham so thank you so much shubham for coming up i hope i shoot another video with you pretty soon and uh, guys don't forget to hit the like button and the subscribe button i'll see you in the next one happy coding